All right. Um, this is a different type of video. I'm a little angry, and I just want to express something. And I think I have no problem with anger. <laughs> I actually don't have a problem with really many emotions. Um, I have a problem with, by problem, I mean challenge with people resisting emotions. I think, you know, the other day I was expressing to someone how I was feeling insecure, and he told me not to be jealous. And I was like, mm, I don't think jealousy is the issue. I think resisting jealousy is the issue. If we can embrace it, and if we can embrace almost any emotion that we avoid and really dive deep into it and fully feel it, then we'll find out that we can turn some of our biggest problems into our biggest strengths. It's awesome to be jealous. What a form of flattery. Especially when you can express it in a meaningful way. But anyways, the way I'm angry about, <laughs> and I'm just angry that the people that I work with, people that I've hired, that they have to deal with people that are um, obsessed and that are addicted to just talking about things rather than doing them. That we live in this crazy world. We can go on our phone, we can watch someone surf, we can watch someone rock climb, we can watch someone wingsuit down the mountain, and we can watch someone climb Mount Everest just with a quick click of a button. And then we get the feeling that we did it. And then we can tell others about it. And then we can get this feeling, this like subtle feeling of accomplishment rather than actually doing it. And this is not for everyone. This is a stereotype for the general population. There's too many people in the world and there's too many people that reach out to us that I have to start leveraging my time to my advantage. And I want to surround myself with people that inspire me. And that's people that walk the talk instead of talking the walk and thinking they did it. Um, yeah, and what it is is because now we're working with people. I don't want them to feel like I, hopefully they never feel like their time is wasted. Hopefully they realize that whoever they're talking to and whatever challenges they're faced is a growth opportunity. But I don't want them to have to keep talking to people that are just there to talk. I'm done with that. So if you're that type of person, go find some other YouTubers. If you're ready for some real ridiculous fun and really ready to walk the talk and do what it takes, to get paid to pursue your passion and a lifestyle that we want to live. And if you think you can add value to our lives, then hit us up. RobRoz at gmail.com. <laughs> Peace in.